And a tip out into the hands of Isaiah Thompson, the sophomore point guard from Zionsville. Newman a transition three. Brandon Newman, the first five for Purdue. Beverly, the sophomore, got the started point. This is Gack down the lane. Dang Gack with the drive. He had scored nine in a row after Purdue had scored 15 in a row. Mcgusty ends that. Cameron Mcgusty, the transfer from Oklahoma. Gillis looking for Edie down low, and Edie throws it home as Nasir Brooks has hit the deck. Williams ahead on the leak out. A rejection came from Beverly on the shot from Brandon Newman. Here's Mcgusty to push tempo up top, and Brooks throws it down. Knocked away from Wheeler, and here's a takeaway. Beverly on the leak out from Cross, and two fast break buckets start the half for Jim Laranaga tonight, and all eight have played. Inside oh. a bad pass, Stefanovic threw it away. Beverly's had an aggressive start to the half, and Harlan Beverly finishes two with a chance for three. It's a 9-2 Miami run with possession. Augusti fakes it and scores in the lane. The system he gained from playing hockey, from being a baseball pitcher, the footwork, the bend. There's Miami's first three of the game. Augusti. Puts it up, no. Offensive rebound, Brooks around Williams, no. And Cross comes flying in for a one-hand tip. It's a one-point game. A minute to go, and Beverly, who's had a brilliant second half, dribbles it out. Five to shoot. Mcgusty. Williams lets him go, and Mcgusty scores, plus a foul. Williams in the ball screen. Now you got Williams moving. Now he doesn't know how to get back and recover. You can't do it any better. End of game. Mason Gillis can inbound. Gillis's pass is taken away. Harlan Beverly has the basketball and dribbles out a shocker of a comeback for Miami.